you here. Feel, you feel pressure to end this tonight or not go back? Uh, yeah, we want to. There's definitely a lot of pressure. Um, if it goes to game seven, anything can happen. And, uh, it's a situation we don't really want to be in, so uh, we have to make sure that uh, we put our best game forward tonight and give ourselves the best opportunity. Do you have to control your emotions tonight? I mean, to the excitability and the opportunity, obviously, 60 minutes you hope away from the birth of the Stanley Cup Finals. Yeah, we have to, um, you know, we do have to keep our emotions in check. Uh, you know, the uh, Stanley Cup Finals, that's uh, obviously the end goal, but there's uh, still a long way to go to get there. Um, they're going to play uh, an amazing game, game tonight, there's no question about that, so... We have to make sure uh, you know we're really ready to counter these guys and put a, put a good game here. Is that a fine, fine line to walk, though, the, the controlling the emotion yet still having that sort of jump and agitation that you want to, to control play. Yeah, there's for sure. Um, you know, we want to keep our emotions intact, but um, we don't want to change our game at all. And if we do that, um, we try and change a whole lot, then it could, it could uh, affect our game. So we have to make sure we, um, you know, we make sure we keep our emotions uh, intact, but uh, you know, we still play our game and, and we don't let it change our style. Brad, what do you remember? You guys haven't played your best game in this series yet. Do you feel that way? I and mean, what's it take to get that best game? You know? Yeah, I thought uh, you know I thought game three was a close game to. Um, the way we can play, and uh, if we play a game like that, then, uh, we're gonna make it hard on, on, on uh, Tampa tonight. So I think if, uh, if everyone is focused on what they're what they have to do to help the team win tonight, then uh, you know we're we're all gonna put ourselves in a good position and, and uh, you know hopefully put our best game for it on the ice here. What do you remember about the first two games here? The games three and four, both great starts. Obviously, game four didn't you didn't sustain it. But what do you remember about the way you guys came out? I think uh, you know in game three, I think it was big that we got a goal early and. And, uh, you know, I, we, we built a lot of emotion off of that, and uh, we were able to continue pushing forward. And it just seemed like everyone was coming back hard, and, and we were limiting their time and space. And uh, I think that really helped us in, in game four. I think, uh, you know, we just were able to capitalize on our opportunities. I don't think we played any, any better than they did in the first period. Mm -hmm. They just, you know, we scored, and they didn't. Uh, you know, they were able to kind of turn it around in the second and third. Mark, you guys talked about the need for a better start, though, tonight, coming off the first period the other night. You guys yeah. Um, you know, we want to want to carry the momentum from from last game into our first period and make sure that we have a big start. Um, you know, they're going to come out flying tonight and obviously try and get a, an early lead and and uh, build off that. So we have to make sure that um, you know we have a lot better first period than we did last game. We you know we were we were in order to be seen in that first period and uh, we have to make sure that doesn't happen again.